find not working. Well, mine's not working. Stop. Stop. That's what we're doing. Okay. Now I understand. Is that a euphemism? The first one doesn't work. Go to the second one. Young people, you are all computer savvy enough. When you get problems, you have some you have some problem solving skills you need to do first. Sometimes a different browser. Sometimes copying and pasting instead of clicking on. Just simply saying, "Oops, doesn't work." Doesn't always cut it. That's my logic. I know. It's bracket. I don't know if it's the right one, but we'll give it a whirl. And also, if you try and open it from Word online, that may cause a problem. Try that in Firefox. Alex, Alex, you really don't. You don't have to announce everything you do, though. No, no, we don't. Okay. Try it. How do I get out of this? Find something else. Try something else. Internet. Make it work. Because I'm trying this. Computer solving skills is something you people really suck at. Yeah. Yay, pages works. Page solved the problem. First one works. Hey, I figured it out too. Yes. I'm reading. Oh, we already see I got it open. It was a pain. I know. I used a different thing. I used my brain. Oh, I bet. Oh, I can't take this internet. Oh, God. I think I just looked at the chicken away. You, focus. May I go to the bathroom? Because I didn't have time. Why? Because we didn't get out of music till late. And I carried Erica's stuff over here. Why? You're using bum. Because she forgot it and didn't want to make her go all the way back. Can I? After page only Thanks. Spelled. It didn't work. How do you find time? That's not internet. That's why. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> yeah. Because that's where we get backgrounds and she liked changing oh. our backgrounds on her computer. <laughs> Yeah, you can go to Does this hurt? Can we get that uploaded? Wait, no. Now we did it wrong. I didn't really understand it. For some reason, you people sound a whole lot like freshmen today. We just had fire with them. How are you, Mr. It's, he needs a silver light up here. It's telling you you need to plug in, right? Yeah, I, have one good one. yeah, I know. Same. Hang, on, hang on a minute. Daniel, I'm sorry. I have to do this. <laughs> I don't really care. I'm just going to get out of school. Like this one. There's no pictures. Daniel, we're not going to get out of school. I know what you mean. A, a plug in? I try yeah, to I don't think we're getting out of school, guys. Yeah, like, um, looks pretty clear. Kind of like, Unless they call it right after lunch. lunch no, you know what? They're, they're not going to. When added to you. I know. That's right. That means it allows it to, to work. Yeah. I don't know how to so it's like a piece in the puzzle. puzzle. You don't. Now, here's, here's the deal. Um. Remember, browser to browser to browser. Armor school just came out. He just got a notice. Gosh dang it. Burke school today. Tomorrow, Tuesday, December 1st. Burke school. Please watch for further messages as the weather See? develops. Sorry. If there are changes, we will send out another message. If you see a browser, browser, please contact the school at 
then oh. you have to oh, yeah. do something else first. You yeah. mean in a source? Yeah. No. Fred has a bad drink. I'm not understanding. Oh. Maybe and you, you want have to, to do something on this uh, entire thing chicken. first. Have you done all of those? Have you? This is explaining I, how to I know. Listen to me. Have you drink. followed oh. the directions oh. explicitly? Have you read all the directions? Yeah. All of them. Are you doing a dance? All of these are here. Okay, good. So, I'm eating on that one. I knew I spoke Gino type. No. I'm going to say that you're not doing something correct. <laughs> Because you are crossing a heterozygous tall. So do a heterozygous tall. I do something. With a second heterozygous tall. Oh my god, I can smell it through the bottle. So what are you going to end up Don't open it. No, it's taking it. Don't open it. Guys, I grew something in my stinky bottle. It's going to look like genotype. Gentlemen, I'm right here and I can't talk to him because you're too loud. So what are you going to get genetically? What's the genotype? Yeah, no, no, you're giving me pheno. What's the gene look like? And again, we're not using capital and short, right? So what's it going to look like? And then drag that cross. That try that one. Are you sure? Put them in the Punnett Square one. Mr. Schneider, have you tried this? Uh, is it the second one? Yeah. Sir. Sir. Zero bio. The third one pops right up for me. Uh, yes. You're not listening to my full question. <sighs> He's having a hard time dragging stuff. It yeah. won't drag for him instead. Yeah, you That's what I, I, I want you to, can you try that on your computer, please? Mr. Lanza, contact Mr. Grant. Mm -hmm. See if it's a... Broke you have to get this done today. You're not leaving before Wait. this class is over. I have a question. You never know. So, do we have, do we, do we, do we have PowerPoint or do we have another thing? I don't know anything about Always PowerPoint. Always told them, Brady. Hmm. You never know. You don't. Are you on the right assignment? assignment? You just thought you're on the know. second assignment that's supposed to open at 11.30 and decided to open when it wanted to. Mean the square's time Oh, my yeah. gosh. I don't have to do that one? No, not only my dad. I got to slow You started at... I got to do you use one of the websites? Yes, Trevor, you have uh, to. Shh. You shh. Taylor, okay, go on to the next one. Yet. Yes. Only have to do one. Huh? Yes. Only have to do one. The only one of them has to work, actually. I can't get thinkquest.org to open. So I can't so, get that one either. Number two? Yeah. It's a pain. So you have to use the first one. Seven, yo. Not even a I can't get the next. I got to click that one and click the two. Yeah, I just did a, a search, and thinkquest.org doesn't open all by itself, even with that other stuff. So there's a server issue or something. <laughs> With that second site. Actually, that's not quite true either. You can do the second one, you just won't be able to do it online. You'd have to do it on paper. Silly. Right, and it's this is a game review, so they can't do the second one. They could, I mean, they could physically do it. I imagine. That's the one he's just referring to. Yeah. I was just going to bring it up on my computer and see if it's an issue. Which which browser are you using, Taylor? Wrong. I can't get the first two to pull up. The first one, too. I'm assuming, Mr. Schneider, that you're using Firefox? Yep. Okay. I literally put that every hour. Slow, but it works sometimes. Oh, it's crap. 
watched you do the same thing, and I saw you erase the beginning. When the other stuff does it, I that forgot one to. Usually does. When that one does it, I haven't used Internet Explorer until like, I don't know. Right? So we're in the Explorer? Yeah. Right. So we're in the Explorer? Yeah. <coughs> like, it's been so many months. I, I think the last one I actually used Internet Explorer was like. Is there any stuff on the Linux? I don't even know. Probably like 70 or 80. Also doesn't look yeah. in Safari. Yeah. No. ThinkQuest.org does not open. What's yeah. opening? Oh, I'm not on that. What does that happen? You won't want to click out OK. Or when it puts next to the remainder. Could be just a problem with your computer. You. Do a control alt delete. And close it. Yeah, uh, Paige just noticed that too when she got to the end, the next wouldn't work. I told her to do a control alt delete. Mm -hmm. And do what after yeah? End task. I don't have an end task. I have <laughs> Are you on control alt delete task manager? There was an end task manager. What do you get? Yeah. Lock, sign out, and change a password. What if you can't get past the one? Just do a the X out of there. I don't know why you're not getting it. She's in a different thing. What the heck am I supposed to highlight? So I have to start this all over again? Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Be a ninny. Could be a fucking old person. Like, not that you ninny. I have one. So you say something else. Um, I have it so it will come out when you want it. That is a lot of fun. Yeah, this is a place that's not fun. Girl's name. But, my girl's name. Girl's name. One that is Herozygous. And one that is Homer. I named the two girls. Oh, it's literally bad. My list is They're all like, they like call him. Okay. Where's Ty attitude? Furry family. Where did you find that one? That one looks fun. It's a new thing Mr. Schneider put in there. Okay. That was fun. I'm going to go to it. Oh my god, I made more baby rats. I'm not going to have babies. I'm not going to have babies. I just added a one that's a, a hoop shoot one. Okay. Um, you put that in as a comment? Oh god. I did. Oh, I have so much freedom. Oh, <laughs> How do you do this? Now let me do it. What should I do? <laughs> I've added a, there's a bunny one and a hoop shoot one when you get. Hoop shoot? There's a slider. That one's fair. Oh my goodness, I have. No, it's been a boy. Oh, well, okay, I suck. That one's a ride. Fuck, you're sad. My stock. What is this? Yeah, my stock of lemon. Uh, name that one. I need to fix you on the page. I got it. You might. I don't want to do that. Valentine. Yeah. Awesome. Valentine or. Oh, man. Cute cake. No, no, no. Want a bed? I don't know. Does anybody like right. soccer? No. That's a bed. I think it's a bear. Why would you want to do this? Um, thing. Uh, Weezer. Weezer. You should have looked at those things. They were pretty much cool. Stop putting the heartbreaker. Well, Isabelle, you need no. to focus. Sorry. I added one for you soccer fans, too, which is not me. That is not me. I don't think any of us in here like Your timer soccer. has 21 minutes. You uh -oh. have to be done with this. Wait, Mr. Schneider. Okay. Wait, wait, what's one? Yes. Yes. You only have to do one. Yes. That's what she says. It's Erica. He's looking for you to just refresh your memory on Punnett Squares. So I just know what we're talking about. Correct. Can you turn the good one? Just you, kiddo. I didn't even get... It's broken. Hmm? It's broken. Broken. Maybe you're not right. It, it let me do it last time. I know, but maybe you're not right this time. But I can't go back. I last time. Yeah, I know. That's a real thing. Okay. No, I, I have to start over. Damn yeah. it. Uh, There's a virtual lab, too, that we've used in the past uh, that we just added. You should be able to find something to refresh your memory about Punnett Squares. If you can't, you suck. And then you want us to write a report on it? No, credit. Look at now. I do. I want 12 pages. What? Oh, Don't it's a review. You want us to write a review right now. Don't go there. Oh. Work on the Punnett Square part, guys. But I understand the Punnett Square. Do you? I'm an expert. What if well, there's an indominant right. one? Yeah, you understand it so much, you don't even know how to say the word. Not indominant, it's incomplete, right? Is the that the word? Rex? Incomplete? What? What if there's an incomplete gene? Alexander gets around. This doesn't cover that. Can we do the other one, Valentine? Miss Hoppy is about to set it up. Has anybody found how to breed these lemmings? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I do. And I got lemmings going off a cliff. Oh, those oh, did you die? Or is that a good thing? Oh, okay. Did they really? Mm -hmm. Well, that's what they do. If one, if one falls off a cliff, it's like, is that one working? Yeah, I don't know. Whatever the front one does, they all go. Oh, they don't. Do you know how to keep these? Oh, the lining? So the chickens, right? I played that game. I got it. On the 12th try. 12th try. When a header 
Did you include the science? Did you talk about whether it's user friendly or not? Is grade not level appropriateness for 10th yeah. grade biology? Slim, the, the bunny one is really good for the Punnett square, but that science hoop shoot one is really good for figuring out what to put in the Punnett squares. They disc country music. Yes, you listen to Mrs. Schneider. They disc country music in the bunny one. No, they don't. Yes, they do. No, they just say that she Good. sings horribly. Yeah. And then they say to country music. Yeah, but she sings horribly to country music. Doesn't mean she's so singing to the bad country. singer. The hoop shoe yeah. one will also test whether or not you guys are remembering what Vino and Gino means. Your timer has 16 and a half minutes on it. Well, and you have to have a review. Something like you might see about a video game or a book oh God, or a movie yeah, or products on one of them. Oh, I do this place. Yeah, no, it's crazy, right? I can do this. No way. No way. Just a few words. Just a few words. Just a few words. Just a few words. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm not Snapchat. That's a notification. Think about the reviews that you've read before. I was no, one like that. I think it's kind of funny that a whole bunch of... You know, this is easy, but at the same time, this website really sucks. Oh, yeah. 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 There's even a button. No. Does it tell you what No. If you pick up a new game, four ninety five. Oh, you know what I'm gonna let you get for four ninety five. But you don't know if you wanna play it, but you do. We'll try to uh or you Google it, you look at review and something else. And then roll it up. Then you go. You do a full full. Why? You need a genotype. You write a review for another student. Or another student. Just trying to figure out how to do it on the square. Is this a good one to use? Does this one help you figure out the one square? Write about it. Write about it. You've got plenty of stuff in your brain about this. Just put it on paper and you're good. Okay. Hmm. 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 Yep, the cars live, came out of school. I will do it next time. I'll do 26 Mr. Oh, Mr. Schneider does this in a different way. You do the the thingy, and I always like to do that. I will do, th I will do this until the cows come home. She just does the tic tac toe. I will do this, but Mr. Schneider will do it so that he incorporates all of the 
you can get all the different people <coughs> from question. Question uh, 16. Yeah. What did you say? It just wants to know how many of the results would number say it's in phenotype or Schneider. genotype. Okay. Or Mrs. So you gotta do the But again, I'm I'm back. I just drew two you don't dominant right. colors it's shoes, together. But you look and I don't think that's a fair thing to do. Yeah. <sighs> this one would be Well, the sister of Jorge. Make Jan Brown. Jan Scott. So then this, how many of these came out like that? How do you do this one? I'm just going to write a review. How do you do this one? Right here, right here. Read the directions. No, not equal time. Four. Let me see. Where is that dog going to matter, whatever the last kid? Just type it in. Do for the last thing. Did you read the Type it in. Yeah. It's in there. It tells you what to do. So like the gym, you fill in the and then at the end, you do it. Yeah. Yeah, we both had to the first go, and Absolutely. Is this going to be F, F, or is it going to be lower case? So start with that. So look at these, and which oh, answer is a phenotype? And then you click the one. That would so say, what I would literally do, Eric, is yeah. just write it out. What is the yellow plot? Good job. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. Do I have any more? You, you told me that right there, right? Yeah. So you have a oh. yellow pod and. Ew, so ugly. That was ugly. Yeah, that was really great. And what else do you have? You didn't get ugly. Let me figure. Dominant green, which is just. It says homozygous yellow. Victor, so we just says that they're married, but they have two different last names. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it would be a lot of Give it to me. What does it look like? Oh, I got it. God bless you. I'm good. Don't mind. It's all right. And the magazine is two capitals. And they have the same phenotype and different genotype. Yes. And you're pointing at letters. Just do do C ones. Let's see. Just just do it. 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 Just do Genotype, right? Isabel. Oh, it's in the same Jorge and Philip are girls. What? Jorge and Philip are girls, and Janet is a boy. Oh, okay. So the G. To heck with gender norms. 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 Gender nor
What name does the assignment have? What name does the assignment have? Just copy and paste it out of it. Photo. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> you have that name, school and front. Using that, then click the button. Okay. Well, okay. So learned after two years. <laughs> so it only took a year and a quarter and a half. Well, it took you a little bit of time. The bunny's fur brown. That would be five and a half quarters of school. Okay. So which one is brown? Give me. Just for time. I don't know which one is brown. New gender. New gender. Now they have to take a try for you. His brown is going to be recessive. Unless you're like with them. How do you do this one? How do you like? How do I make Billy a girl? Trevor, try. Make Billy a girl. We didn't have to go. Oh wait, yeah. Do you know that in the beginning there's two pink boxes and a blue box for a reason? Yeah. Are you trying to make Billy a girl? Gracie, there's a little bit of sarcasm in your voice. Just a little. Do females or males have the X and Y chromosomes? Did you get that? Have you written? Oh, that's what they're talking about. You want a girl to be a girl. You just got to win. That's a male. Hey, that's a male. First of all, stop screaming at him or take your headphones out. Do about anything you want. See, that was a little more challenging. Yeah. You have to think a little bit. And you, if you think you can read them and just kind of do it in your head, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Just like a math problem. I can't. I can't. Brooklyn side has a tool that's a pain in the butt. Well, I suck it. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. I just had a little bit of a problem. Hunter, do you have your review done? Mr. Schneider, what is your six by six rule? Do you want them to do the presentation? Like, um, eventually, yes, yeah, but don't have to worry about the presentation right this minute unless your other one's already done. Let me see your pants. Six words across and six rows high. Six rows high should put yourself in screen. And if not, then your letters are probably too small. If you have more rows in there. I do have some good news and for you. Year, we what? We get out? Corsica Stickney's out at 1230. Oh, my God. Well, we're getting out. I need another one. Of course, yeah, it's all we're Did you do the review? This is so dumb. You don't get out. I think we'll go to play. Daniel, go to play. Go to another one. Come out. 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 Yeah, I can't, yeah, see I can't even see down the road to see your vehicle. Hey, the last time Riley bought the Geo, I know that's why I'm saying can't like, see. I can't even see my minivan. Oh, I'm not the minivan. Oh, no, I'm not the minivan. No, no, no. no. People, there's an awful lot of sophomores that are skipping the review. Do the review. Wait, time out. Are we supposed to? Do? Are you asking that because you because you were just working on one? So do you not know where it's at? Weren't you just working on the review? Oh, you mean where we write about it? Those are all the games. Yeah. I know. You just asked me where is the review? Can we do anything? Anything? Do we have to put our like writing on a different? It's Mrs. Paper? Keller. Yes. Okay. She's not coming what? out today, but. Maybe sometime later. Yeah, yeah, Alan, right. Okay. Show off the baby. Show off the new baby. Mr. Schneider's. Mine is. Oh, the maybe misses. I don't know. Not mine. Me neither. Well, all my buddies have been girls so far. It's making me mad. It's going away. Are we in China or something? No, it is. Look at it. So, do we review for every website? What does it we'll tell you, Hunter? Name them at the guys, and then, like, the walls are going in. Big old glass walls oh, and garage doors. Where at? That doesn't sound good. Glass garage doors. Yeah. Glass, glass walls, walls and garage doors. 
In the garage door tell Hunter, what's the type? About one of them. There you go. Do we put this in you in the same document or do we make a whole set of documents for I've been telling no. people to put it in a different document. Put it in a different document and uh -huh. upload it. There you go. That's fine. Um, I would put it at the first page, though, not the not the last page. Just go change it and upload it again. <laughs> Isabel, what part of this are you on? I'm right here. Great. Focus. You mean the review that's supposed to be done in like a minute? Oh. Yeah, I know. I'm almost done. I'm scared. I don't even know what to all say because all I got is this much. Right, but don't go. Young people, don't go out to the web to try to find a review. What do you think? For the love of my kid, I don't think any reviews. It doesn't matter. What do you think about what the site was? I already wrote it. This is way too much. Why is that? Seems like seems like a building that she worked in. Oh, she works. How did it help you understand? There used to be a warehouse. How will it help you with play it? Look at all those things that you can make more specific. What's your question? What do you expect? I think we need a school. You were just talking ten minutes ago how we want to get out of school. Now you're saying, "Dang, go complain to Mr. Brown." Yeah, just like just how like he was throwing up this morning, but yeah, he came to school. Yeah, young people, nobody cares. Finish. Sometimes. She's making holes in the snow about three inches deep. Are you serious? Hey, it's a cop. They're oh. leading up from the funeral. Oh. There's a funeral? It's John. Oh, Bill George Trump. Yeah. <laughs> What do you say? Daniel, if you don't shut up, you're not going to see anything. You couldn't catch me. Daniel said he couldn't see his house from here. He's looking out that way. 33 seconds to go. He's a well-loved guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I see. Well, actually, Michael Troy is what was the camper. Oh, I remember that. Eight bunnies out of CC church for some reason, not the Methodist or the Lutheran. What? I did it. Oh, I think the Young people, specifics on your review. Green juice leaking out your ears or nothing? Not yet. Yeah, specifics would be another word for details. I'm really happy. Burke's getting up early, is that what they said? One o'clock. And it said they were going to see about tomorrow. They no, it already says it. Mrs. Schneider. Yes. Well, I guess I can sell my own house. Never mind. 
I got this. Oh, soccer. It's yeah. just starting to move into Gregory. I don't know if it's good or not. Look at that. Mr. Schneider, I didn't mean that in a bad way. Oh, it's very good. Right? No. No, it's not here, man. Where is it? You always gotta be warm, Mr. Schneider. Who is it? I don't know. Oh, big! She's got a three quarter inch hole, and when she tied the tie on, it went in about this far when she tied it. Mr. Schneider, have you ever met someone named Bob? Sure. Yeah. My my. Uncle I didn't ask you, Squire. Actually, yeah, yeah I have. Bob. He's. I got a neighbor named Bob. Bob. I went to high school with. Bob actually really is good. Technically, my second cousin is Bob. They have fifteen of them. Oh, that's hot. I was scared of she made. What? They run the stop sign. They rolled it. Closing at twelve thirty. Ethan. Closing at twelve thirty. No, get your work done. I have my work done. Oh. Gregory's closing at 12.30. Wait, Gregory's closing at 12.30? Oh, my God. I have that. I'm on page 72. No, I'm not. But thank you. I'm at 11.45. He snapped on you. Why, did you tie your slack? No, Bradley, I don't think any Gio parent too? in their right mind would let their kid drive an hour and a half. Oh, yeah. Would you drive the pickup? Yeah, Did you drive your pickup today? Yeah. And my, my car is shut off. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're the only school. No, no, no. Parsons got out. No, they got out. out. Oh, yeah, they have to get out. Parsons and Morris are out. Parsons is getting out at 12 30. Parsons never gets out of school. So I still was going to get a pop. Mitchell's open until 1 45. Well, that's why I haven't got the text yet. All right, people. Um, Your time is beyond up for the first one. They never get out. Your assignment for today was to spend half the class on that review and basically reviewing Punnett Squares. You did Punnett Squares in junior high. Punnett Squares are not that hard. Terminology. How do we say the... Um, the A word? There's three of them right here. How do we refer to this one? Uh, down. <coughs> I need an H word in front. Happily. Hi, hi, heterozygous. This gene pair is heterozygous. Is it dominant or recessive? Recessive. That's recessive. That's dominant. Recessive. Oh, that's dominant. Dominant. Is this thing as a whole or as a rule? Yeah. This thing. Oh, it's dominant. That's dominant. This pair is Wait, heterozygous oh. dominant. Why Mr. do we say dominant? Dominant refers to the... So. Heterozygous refers to the whole thing. G word. Yeah, she's right. The whole thing, she said. Genotype. <laughs> and dominant refers to the Big phenotype. phenotype. Wait a minute. So dominant is green in this case. Mm -hmm. But what if this was two T's? Gentlemen, you need a, to listen. And it was a capital T and a lowercase t for tall. Is a capital T, lowercase t still the same as this? Yeah. yeah. In what way? It is it heterozygous? Yeah. yeah. Is it also dominant? Yeah. yeah. Mr. And do we need to talk about whether tall or short is dominant after we do it like three or four times? No. Can you, you get it in junior high, right? Which one's dominant for pea plants? He's tall. How do you know it's tall? There's a way. <coughs> There's a scientific fact that tells you that capital T, little t, is for tall. Why isn't it capital S little S? Wait, get, I was going to say. Why do we use T's instead of S's? Why are you tall? P for tall. Because tall is dominant. We always use the letters from the dominant ones. So if this is a G and we're dealing with green and yellow, we automatically know which one's dominant. Green. Green. If it wasn't, we'd be using Y. Because yellow would be dominant. Oh. Two. Oh. oh, dude. But well, two, th two things I want. Time out. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I know what. This flower is what color? White. White. It's not purple. Why not? Well, White. blue and brown. This flower is purple. That is an excellent question, Parker. 
What about blue and brown? Very, very. And black. Oh, like pink and purple. And black. Yeah. What yeah. do we do with eyes? With blue and with brown. Oh. Oh, because it, wasn't it blue dominant. is recessive. That's all I know. Wasn't it's being dominant, blue is recessive. Blue is recessive. So when we do a R? brown eyed allele from your father and a blue eyed allele from your mother, exactly what do we do with blue and brown? Don't you do BL to pinky? No, that should be brown. No, this is okay. a brown allele, this is a blue allele. Okay. Because lowercase b is recessive. Yeah, this one has to be recessive, and you know that blue is recessive. It's one of those that you absolutely just have to know. It's kind of like knowing your, your squares all the way up through 12. You but should just absolutely know it. With these things, you can do just a little tiny bit of research. And is this a red flower crossed with a purple flower or a red flower crossed with a white flower? Or a red cross with a pink? Don't to know. There's going to have to be some writing along with a Punnett square. And you have to read the writing. You can't just read the Punnett square. Two things that kids like usually screw up is we'll hear about heterozygous recessive. Can it happen? No, it's homozygous. It's always going to be homozygous recessive. The other thing, because you're dealing up there with the Gs, the, the problem that the girls were working were green and yellow. And a lot of times people will put a capital G and a little Y. A little y. Because they don't want to do G, which is green, for yellow. And then you do that Punnett square for them. No, do like a G and a Y, please. Oh. Show them what happens. If you end up with two alleles that are different genotypes like that, you probably at this level have done something very wrong. It does. And you should that should go through your head when you do that at this level. I'm not going to tell you you won't see something like that when you are a geneticist. You will see this with paint. And gender. Oh. Biscuit. He heard somebody at the door. Why did somebody come up that way? That could be slippery. If this is paint and you're mixing half green and half yellow, you're going to end up with greenish yellow paint. Yellow. Right? I don't, I don't, I don't know it's pronounced <laughs> jello. I say so, I believe it's pronounced Yeen. jello. With these, oh, this Jesus. one is. Yellow. And that's a phenotype or a genotype? Uh, genotype. And the genotype the here is? <laughs> Homozygous recessive. Yeah. See, I played this stupid game and it didn't tell me this way. So I gave it a bad review. <laughs> Homozygous dominant. And what does it say? Um, big long H word on the bottom of the front label of your milk. Yes. What do they do to your milk before you can drink it? Pasteurize and the H word. Homogenize. Homogenize means to make it homogenous. When you milk a cow into a bucket, do you have the same thing? On the top, on the left, on the right, in the, in the middle, no. and on the bottom no. of the bucket? No. What's at the top of the bucket? Cream. Cream. I love it. Right? And there's milk at the bottom? So when we split that, can we get 100% of the cream off, no matter what we do? No. Probably not. If we do get 100% of the cream, we probably got... Cats. Quite a bit of milk with it. Cats. In order to make it the same all the way through, you have to homogenize. <laughs> So when we make something homogenous, where's the genius in there? In the homogenous. In the genius. Genius is your brain. Genius is your abilities. There's no genius in your genes. These are homogenous and heterogeneous. You tell what it is. So were you? There's no I. There's no I in homogenous. But some people will say homogeneous. 
Well, that's a gay guy that's really dang smart. <laughs> <laughs> this is homogenous and heterogeneous. Get rid of the genius in there because it makes you sound like you're way far away from one when you say that word wrong. Okay? Homogenous. Did I cover all the terms that you need to know? Yeah. What, what are these things? <laughs> Together, there's an allele. What about this? An allele. That's an allele. And this is another allele. Right? And pairs of alleles make up a genotype. A genotype, but they make up a chromosome. And chromosomes are... Those squiggly things. They look like... I always think they look like, um, uh, oh, that's a bad marker. what do you call those things? Yeah, like Thank you. Boomerang. Oh, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 Are you going to Oh, oh Brooklyn. Yeah. Brooklyn. That was a good one. Wait, what did you say? That's why you're a ref. <laughs> <laughs> no, I threw the whole thing. I hit the ref. <laughs> you suck, too. That's why you practice. I don't really care. Ooh, roasted. Karma, karma comes around, lady. There should be more colors. Right? Yeah. There's, that there's a blue thinking? one right there. There's a blue one on the desk. I'm so red. Is that what you're thinking? When you see these? Yeah. I'm like those red ones. Now, now I see that. Like my skin is just red. Yeah. Ugh. What now? That's what you should be thinking, because that's what we're doing. So together. When do these split? No, 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 stop. Before you answer, think yeah. about the phases that you now know. And as metaphase. They go to the middle and metaphase. Calphase. Anaphase? No, it starts with. It's the S one. No, calphase. Anaphase, they tear, tear, tell it by. Anaphase, they come apart. Apart. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I thought telophase was tear. Telophase, the whole thing tears in two. So your whole big cell splits into two little cells. That's why teachers always do that, because they're exactly half the size of the whole thing. Hang on a minute. Because that's what happens when you clean. Cleavage? What? I'm all down to talk about cleavage. <laughs> Not your cleavage, Parker. Not mine. I don't care about mine. Cleavage is things... <laughs> Cleaving into the big giant oh, meat that's cutter that's inside. this big, that's a blade that sits about yay high and has a handle sticking out over here, and you and you chops into. It's called a cleaver. It's a meat cleaver. Hang on, hang on, Hunter. What's the acronym for the different phases, and what are the phases? I P Mac. Good. Inter interphase. Prophase. Good. Metaphase. Think girl's name. Grace's mom. There you go. Anaphase. There you go. Ah. And telephase. Very good. Gracie's love phase. Gracie's <laughs> mom phase. Gracie's mom's name phase. There you go. Yeah. Don't, don't get me started on 80 songs. So they're called alleles. They used to sing that all the time in grade school. Yeah. Ask that again. Somebody just somebody just asked me. Yeah. She she had a question. So together their chromosomes and then apart their alleles. Yes. Okay. What if the two chromosomes split? Are they then called alleles again? No. Oh, this chromosome and this chromosome Correct. split. These this is a chromosome pair. And they split into individual chromosomes. So they'd still be chromosomes. Yes. So yes. once they're joined. And this, once they're joined, they're chromosomes. If they're apart, they're alleles. Chromatid and allele. So chromatid and allele mean the same thing? Yeah. A chromatid is just half of any old chromosome. Show and them allele visually. Is is half of this pair. Do it do it visually for me, please. That'd be awesome. Can you do that? Your mom's a bummer. It's just half of an X. Okay. No, it was and that so is a chromatid. And, and this cell, Somebody we can said you're draw a cell right. cleaving, right? Give me that. 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 Give me
much Isabel listen now that you asked dad. the question. Right. Then it's two separate cells. And this happens in what process? You're, you're talking about Meiosis. a specific part of what's the big process called? Mitosis. Meiosis and mitosis. If these things end up in here, are they a process of meiosis or mitosis? Now stop and think. Put in, put in Mary's 15 second roll. Why are we doing this? Oh, it's male and female. Two. Which means the process has to be which one? Meiosis. Has to be meiosis. Because meiosis is involved in sexual reproduction. And that's what we're talking about here. Anytime you're doing a planet square, it's sexual reproduction. Asexual reproduction produces identical copies of what you had to start with. The things down in here, the things in the box, are offspring. Yeah. And these things are parents. Parents. So we call that the P1 generation. And this is the F1 generation, the first filial generation. And that's either Latin or ancient Greek, and we don't care. It means offspring. When we cross this one and this one, like you did with the um, lemmings, when these two cross, they would produce the F2 generation. All right. You now need to go into um, the ratio. Because inevitably, how many, Eric, I'll pick on you, in that Punnett square that's up there right now to his left, how many of those kids that GY, which would be GG, and the other one will have, how many of them are going to be green? All right. How many kids did they have? Four. Or. What if they have 12? Oh. So still be all green. Be all. What if they have two? Still be all Do you, you know where they usually go wrong, yeah. right? Okay. The appropriate way to write the phenotypic ratio for this, which is how you say that, that's the ratio of the phenotypes. What's the phenotype of the offspring? Green. All of them? Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm still thinking about getting all of them. Four out of four green. You could also write it it's with four colon four. It. You could also write it with four, two, four. four completely on top of four. Is there a preferred? Uh, most often you will see that one because it's typewriter friendly. Okay. It works on a on a word processor, it works on web pages and like all kinds of fun stuff. The genotypic ratio is ah, now you got him. Be capital G, lowercase G. No, we don't use capital and lowercase. Okay, um, dominant. No, how do you say it? What kind of a dominant? dominant there you go. Homozygous. <laughs> Homozygous dominant, two on four. We don't reduce. In math, you're told to reduce all the time. <coughs> because we need to know if you did a four square or if you did a 16 square. Because you can do Punnett squares with multiple traits, and then you end up with 16. You end up with four of these. Can you do a Punnett square with a homozygous blue-eyed mom? And a heterozygous blue-eyed dad or brown-eyed dad. Homozygous. Mom. Homozygous blue and heterozygous brown. Do the mother Is and the father go in specific all places? All yes. yes. Dad always goes on top. Have a heterozygous. Yeah. Uh, if you want to remember it that way, <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> That is, yeah. Sure, you were. That's what I want. Okay, good. <laughs> I went that way. I'm All right. Like, men deserve to be on top. There you They're go. Supreme. And everyone else is like, sex. No. <laughs> <laughs> but the phenotype would be. Brown. 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 
That's LOL right there. <laughs> yes. And, and let me ask the question at the end because I know where some of them will screw up. Okay. Was First and only time. Right there. This capital B goes straight down. Yeah. Yeah. This little b goes straight down. Why did I put the capital B on the left and a little b on the right? The capital B always goes on that side. The, capital always the, goes the dominant this B allele. Has to go that way. This one has to go that way. All right. Oh, great. It like so, stopped smelling. Ah, Haley. Oh, this couple have three kids. How many of them are blue eyed? Two. Anybody want to agree or disagree? I disagree. She, I she agree. did exactly what I knew she would do because everybody does it. How many of them are going to be blue eyed? Blue eyed? Correct answer, one and a half. He was finishing his answer. Let him, please. Yes. Daniel, finish your answer. You can't really have a half kid, though. So. Right. But statistically, you can have a half a kid. Yeah, but there's two What's options. What's the age of the kids in this room? Probably going to be a decimal, right? But you're either 15 or 16. Here's what everybody does when they do pun and squares. If I tell you that this couple has four kids, they want to say they have two brown-eyed kids and then they have two blue-eyed kids. Because they do one, two, three, four, or they do one, two, three, four. And, and that's not how it works. You can't do that because... It's not right. It, well, of so, course, it's, it's not right, but why can't it be done, let's Haley? Let's, let's put the pause on that sure. one. Sure. And let's do these. Okay. What's the phenotypic ratio? Uh, of the offspring. Two out of four. <coughs> one half. One to one. No. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And then the genotypic ratio, we have this and this. Phenotypic ratio and the genotypic ratio is the same. No, thing. you didn't do a. No. I, you no. so confused me on that. <laughs> that what goes up here? Oh, is it the two to factual ratio? Yep. Don't get those confused. But your bottom one is still wrong. Phenotype is facial features, physical features, so the things that you see. It's your nose. It's how long your arms are. You have two eyebrows and one. What's wrong with this bottom one? Okay. We're paying attention a little bit. So now, Haley, how come we can't determine that we're going to have two brown and two blue? Back to the three kids? Correct. Because they're only having three kids. No. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Nope. Look at that. Go back to the sock or the card question. Was it cards? What did Mrs. Um, Keller use as a, as a ratio the other day, as a proportion? Flipping huh? Coins. Flipping coins. That's what this means. This means it's 50-50 whether you're going to have a brown-eyed kid or a blue-eyed Could they have three brown-eyed kids? Yeah. Could yeah. they have three blue-eyed kids? Yeah. Absolutely. The world may never know. And the dad has brown eyes, so if they have blue-eyed kids, he's mad. Yeah. Right? He's supposed to be dominant. He's sticking it. <laughs> no. That's not the way it works. Can two brown-eyed parents have blue-eyed kids? My dad yes. Yeah. Yeah. How? Somebody tell us. Oh, go ahead, Parker. All right. So what happens is that they both get the recessive gene of the blue eyes, but they also got a dominant brown eyed uh, gene. So when they met up, <laughs> when they did the business, they gave them the <laughs> did the they, business. <laughs> they gave they have the that square in the bottom right, which is BB. 
That's both, they're both blue. They make a BB. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is how two brown eyed parents have blue eyed oh, kids. Oh, now she's got brown brown haired parents have a blonde kid. My parents, My did, parents that. did that. There's blondes on both sides of the family, isn't there? Yes. Uh, I don't really know, honestly, because my mom's not a natural blonde. She's a brunette. But she, you can well, be a brunette a with a, a, a recessive blonde allele. Yeah. Okay, guys. Is this not hard or is this hard? It makes sense. You have to know your terminology. Hetero, homo, pheno, geno. You have to know that. That part on the side doesn't make sense. This Which stuff isn't right anymore. Should we, should we fix it? Because I changed this. Sure. I changed this yes. allele. Yes. Which changed this genotype and that one. So now these numbers are no longer correct. How many of these kids have brown hair or brown eyes? Three out of three. So I got to change that. But again, you're not saying that three out of the four of them do. You're saying no. three out of the four of them could. We're saying these are the odds that you're going to have a brown-eyed kid. Give me a percentage. There you go. And this one needs to change into? Give me a percentage. One point. So every kid that comes out of this cross has a 75% chance of have brown eyes and a 25% chance of having or we could take this to the uh, lemmings that you did and use brown hair and white hair. Or albinism like you guys have. Down here we should change this by adding homozygous dominant one fourth. Heterozygous dominant two fourths. Homozygous recessive one fourth. And does that help, Isabel? There's not much I can do other than go through all No, I just didn't get the P and the G part. Phenotype, genotype. Phenotype, phenotype means what, Isabel? Physical. Okay. Genotype means? Genetically. You're not Isabel. What's in the gene? Well, like, Sorry, oh, she wasn't answering. Fest. What? You're a good ventriloquist. <laughs> Is everybody okay? Are we going to get out of school? Not Question? Not really. Look at I'm it. I'm kind of not okay. Look at Because you need to be okay, and the next assignment will get you okay. Uh, so, that is like what is actually on the chart, the G, and then the P is the like, is like... What's it going to look like? Yep. What are the genes that are going to be there, and what's it going to look like? Why do you have to do the bottom one? What's the point of that one? I, under already have I understand. This that. one's really important if you're breeding dogs or cats or horses or cows or something and you want specific traits. Oh. On, um, on Facebook this weekend, I saw pygmy cows. Miniature no, cows. They're not. Oh, tiny cows. They're like full grown cows that are like yay big. Oh, yeah. And somebody said, I gotta have one of those. Where do I get them? I want one for my backyard. That's how they got them in the first place. You can make them. You have to do the genes. Put in a little bacteria. And you have to take this <laughs> male and this female and cross them on purpose in order to get something that you're trying to get, just like you did with the lemmings on that assignment. But isn't it also the oh, like the invasive genes? Like, mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Oh, I love Boy, oh my yeah. gosh. Girl. Yep. So. What's that called when you take this one and that one and you cross them on purpose to try and get something that you're trying to get? Breeding? Selective breeding. Yes. It's almost like vivisection oh, in Moreau. Oh, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Except that his is portrait. Why? Vivisection, they never explain that. Because he's like attaching different Cutting things up yeah. and apart. Yeah. And so this one specific Whereas this thing is a natural Oh no, none of this is yeah. necessarily natural. No, selective breeding where they're where they're actually like like the only one really does pertain is the females anymore. Yes, but selective breeding has become a lot of unnatural. Yeah. Oh, like where they inject them? Well, no, like where we're like where we're putting together a Newfoundland and a very miniature Schnauzer in order to get this Schnaufenden. Yeah. Oh, so those kinds have, of like, things. Oh, like a whole bunch of health problems? Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, it causes 
causes yeah, like a pugs. lot of problems. Yeah, like pugs. Yeah. <laughs> They're cute and all, but or even my dog all. with the long neck. They're dying neck. inside. They bred those dogs to be shorter and longer. That's why they're like. Because they needed more body weight so they could stay warm in the wintertime. And now they have back problems. I can't even see. Long. And you're right with the vivisection. I mean, he's literally attempting to change the gene makeup, but the 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 idea behind it is the same. Selective breeding happens all over the place. You already talked about it in class when we had all the tables. Tables. <laughs> what? We had all the GMOs. Tables. Yeah, you weren't here for that. Oh, when we were talking about turtles. GMO debate. Because they take this corn plant and this corn plant and they cross them on purpose to try and get certain traits. The big, the big bog. Something that'll go through a drought. Something that'll grow really fast. All of the above, Paul. whatever. Mm -hmm. He's so, a lot of ears. your next assignment, I need you to get started on. I need you to spend 20 minutes on between now and What's the that? beginning of class. Presentation. Presentation. It's in Google Sheets. It has to be. Not Google Sheets. Google, Google Slides is what they call it. There it is. You have to use Google Slides. So I want you to get started. I want you to use a dark background. In Burke the other day, we figured out in a room where you can't turn the lights down really much at all, a dark background and light letters projects better. Can you which, you that out? which I did. I don't. It's logic. <laughs> we don't have twenty. Logic and science are related. So, so I want you to go through and and look at my instructions. I want you to have the instructions all figured out. I want you to have the material all figured out, and I want you to have a plan. <coughs> Can you give me a, a plan? I don't hate you. Give me one or two slides. There's only 18 chapters. Oh. Here, there's like 23. 22. Take, Listen to him. Take my instructions, add one or two slides at the bottom of a plan. First, I'm going to have to explain this thing, and then I'm going to have to explain that thing because it comes next, and then I'm going to have to explain the other thing. And and I'm going to include pictures of this and not pictures of that. Do you want us to explain it? Yes. Do you want our plan in the PowerPoint? Just put it right on the end of my directions. Actually, put it at the beginning of my directions. Wait, what plan? So we have to save the one that you Grab the one that I got. Save it. With your last name and plan. Where? How? How do you save it? I am so confused. Save link as. You have uh, you have downloaded stuff no, in okay. Edmodo all year long. Uh, and you have been opening crap in the internet instead of saving it to your drive. Rename it. Save it in your folder. Rename it with your last name and plan. That's all I need. <coughs> last name plan. Plan. P L A N. The first slide should be your plan. The first slide or two should be your plan. The the third, fourth, fifth slide, whatever's at the end, should be my instructions. So you don't even have to start one. First thing I want you to do is modify one. What do we save it How do you save it? Your last name plan. Question. Great click, like, save link as. All the time. I did. Thank you, Paige. You did that with just that enough in anger words. in your voice. I appreciate it. Oh. Just enough oh. derision as well. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I did that. I saved the link as and then I opened it and nothing showed up. Why? I don't know. Did you download? No. I'm going to rip this. Which browser are you using? Google Chrome. Is that just enough? You did that a bunch of times. It should be Google Slides, so it has to open right in Google Chrome. It just does. It does. Did you? Show me what you opened. Yeah. There's a download that you should right click on, not the file name. Yep. Mr. Schneider, you right click on Open the download link. button, not the file name. Open. Underneath the underneath the thing, there's a little box that's a download. In Enmodo? Yes. No, in Google Chrome. Stop you, talking. People, this thing only works in Google. It is Google Slides. Hey, I'm trying to talk. Don't talk right over top of me. Only works in Google Slides. Open a new tab. Does it work? So you open it. Mm -hmm. Isabel's looking at it. How do you save that once it's open on your screen? 
Well, there is this little beer. Save and as. Download it PDF. Yeah. It I'm with Taylor. You can just right click and it says save as. Okie dokie. Okay. Yeah, but, but do you have to open it first or can you do that from the link? You can do that right Hey, guys, if you do that, it doesn't work. If you yeah, do it from the link, it won't work because it has to open in Google Slides. Which means that they can, if they need to, and they're really struggling, they could put it into their portfolio. They could put it into their own portfolio, exactly. yeah. It would just be just peeky That was where I was headed with that. It opens for me. That's because you opened it on the internet first. You didn't right click on the link and save it. If you save the link and change the name, it's not going to link back to my stuff and it's not going to open. If you open it, and then you save it in your own so Google Drive. It and then go to your Google Drive and upload it in your Google Drive. There you go. Yes, I know, but it's not only saves that one I'll be honest save. with you. Uh, in Google and Edmodo, you can connect your Google to your to your Edmodo. Yes, you can. I would not, but you can. Why do you suggest not? Uh, because I think you guys would screw it up. Probably. Well, what are we supposed to do after this? Uh, Get it open? Yeah. Your assignment is to make a whole new Google Slides on explaining this. But for what have next you done? Time, you have to have a plan. Did you put it into your Google Drive? Your Google portfolio, Alex. Did you put it in there? I don't know how to do that. Yes, you do. You drag it over. Or you go to your Google portfolio and you click on new and hit file upload. That doesn't work. There you go. Make a plan. Mr. Schneider, you've what done that in English are you already, explain Alex. All of these terms in because there's a whole bunch of vocabulary we went over on the board without actually download. writing it, and now you have to actually write it. Where's your portfolio? Yeah. Oh, they're new. I did it wrong again. Mr. Schneider, mm -hmm. there you go. If I'm identical not. twins are different races, are they still identical twins? Can identical no. twins be different races? Yeah. Yeah. No, because they wouldn't be identical. But I didn't know if, like, like well, they have, like, all the same, like, qualities, like, face-wise. They're just, like, one has brown skin and one has white skin. I just didn't know if they but were... But then they're not identical. Yeah. Yes, they well, are. Being right. <laughs> no, they're no, not. Let's get refreshed. They have different Even genes. sometimes twins will look the same you because it's the you parents kind of look the same. The parents have kind of, they both have big noses and Mr. wide Shire. mouths and, uh, you know, the kids are going to have big noses and wide mouths. Mm -hmm. not it's not letting them let it go. Yeah. I don't want to get on Now What has been issued for, like, yesterday already? Yeah, there's no way to download this. Yeah, there's not my... I get one slide. It's like, we're going to say... Oh, my word, stop, stop talking. We, we are aware of some of the problems you are having. Here's part of my problem. You guys aren't trying to solve the problem. You're just shouting out the problem. Try some things. Mr. Schneider will get this figured out. If you're having a Java problem, that is not an hour problem. That is a network problem. Can That's a different issue. Can we just make our own like, Google slide here and then just submit it to Edmodo? Absolutely. We don't even have to download this? I don't know why you're trying to download it, to be honest with you, but you are. Because we're supposed to put the slide, their plan at the beginning of these slides. So why don't we modify that? Can we modify that? Why don't we just put it in a Word document and then... Because we have to put it in Google we Slides. Have all his questions. And you all know how to use Google Slides. This isn't even a problem. So we can go into Google Drive and make a new presentation and then do it on there? That seems to me that would solve the problem. Or you could go to your assignment and look at the reply that I just put in there. Thank you. All right. And if you click that, It open right up. No, it wants permission. Where did you? I just shared it. Yeah. He just he just needs to don't ask for permission. Don't send him 112 requests, guys. Just chill a second. He just needs to change. His, I did that too. He just needs to change his his thingy. Everybody who sent a request fails. Oh. It's going to be the first time, and it won't be the last time. <laughs> 
freaked out. Huh? How did that you have to work? change. You have to change. You should have seen Daniel's face the first time he failed. I fixed it. Or Erica, she was freaking out. She failed because she could use the backspace. Erica, <laughs> yeah. He's going to add a new one for you to use. Why didn't we just do this on PowerPoint? Like that's so um, you, do you want to know the reality of that? Is that the state isn't paying for Microsoft products anymore? They want you to use the online version. Oh, so dumb. Well, get over and it. The online version of certain things doesn't do certain things. So we have like to writing. use. We have to start using the PowerPoint on Google. Oh, no. On uh, this particular yeah, side. I think you did. Did you? Yeah, I mean, like. Hit refresh. State isn't paying for it. Did you? That's why you have to you start to add it in. I erased the old one and Don't go anywhere. One. Refresh. I did it and I saw it. If you get out of school today, we don't have English 2, you need to read through 17. If you have no school tomorrow, you have to finish the book. The same thing popped up. It didn't work, Mr. Schneider. Why are you hating me? It took me, it took me an hour to read three chapters. We don't have to finish the book. Well, we'll get this figured out by the end of the day. Make sure that you get that downloaded. Yeah. I'm going to go home and have dinner, and then I'm going to go to work on this and find a way. If I have to email it to every single kid so that you can have your own little link, then that's what I'll do. But you'll have it. And that's due Wednesday? The plan is due Wednesday. Which means you have to go in and figure out how to do it. You don't have to do it, you just have to figure out how. So that you can sit in class and do it. I guess I can probably do that. Mr. Schneider, is it possible for your genes to change as you age? Nope. Well, your I genes would... can deteriorate, they can copy incorrectly, and then forever copy incorrectly. Well, I was but your born genes with red hair, and then when I was six I had 